bam it's video game time welcome yeah. welcome to uh where this is day day six day day something or other of license licensing to chill and uh licensing to chill. license zing to chill and uh because uh, Mexi had to uh, back out uh, due to uh, some unforeseen uh, uh, circumstances, uh, I jumped in to take over for him playing the Lizzie McGuire game on GBA. Because, well, since the Daily Raffle is the Lizzie McGuire movie, we kind of couldn't get rid of it. So Now, MBM being the, the speed king, uh, the speedrunner man, uh, I assume he was able to complete this game in an hour because he knows it inside out. But do you, Stefan? Well, I mean, I I, I, try, I did like a little quick test playthrough, and I realized it isn't really a game, more so just a bunch of mini games. So oh, it isn't okay. even like an actual. But yeah, let, let's 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 start this up. We'll be fine. Okay, so I'm gonna need be I'm gonna need you guys to let me know how the balance is between uh, Steven's audio and the music because they're kind of sharing the same. Uh, the same audio. If everybody thinks I'm too quiet, it's probably because I'm whispering. So if you think I'm too quiet, let me know. Um. Yeah, how does that how's that audio sounding? Oh, interesting. For some reason, I thought we'd be getting graphics of the actual human being. I don't know why I didn't assume nah. it'd be the cartoon. Kind of a dumb assumption. Um, Agumame wants to know who the Lizzie McGuire movie is signed by. Uh, it's signed by Gareth. And, I mean, if you want, like, I, I, I assume you could probably also get it signed by, like, TJ or Chris, since they're also, uh, since they're, like, they're, they all, like, in the same area. And so you if, know what? If, I bet if you want Johnny in there, we can send it to him, too. Okay. So, is the game, is the game too quiet? Is it, uh... They say the game is almost silent. So okay, I, I boosted it up a bit, so how about this? How does this sound? How does that sound? Hmm. They say a bit more. Okay. Yeah, just because the way the emulator works uh, on my computer, it's like your audio and the game's audio, the, your audio and the game's audio are coming out of the same channel, and I don't know how to fix it, so I'm just gonna have to work oh. with. I'm just gonna have to work with uh, using the the computer. Uh... Well, why don't you adjust uh, the audio until the game sounds good, and then go into Discord and lower me or raise me? Yeah, that's what I. Yeah, that's what oh, I'm Okay, cool. Okay, so Mike. does it sound good now? <laughs> well, Mike says it's fine, but uh, everyone else, how does it sound? How do we sound? Okay, Games Game Busters UK says, I think that's fine. All right. I'll just boost it up a tiny bit more and then we'll go. We'll just we'll just jump into it. Okay. All right. Start. Let's have some fun. Uh, when cheerleaders attack Let's play some games. Got to do a uh, timed game. Okay, so in this so in this game, you're running around uh, collecting uh, CDs at the mall. Well, you're collecting stuff at the mall in general, and you got to jump over some weird things on the ball, some things on the ground, and there are evil cheerleaders running around. So you got to shoot them with uh, sparkly dust. Wait, what? The? That's a lot of CDs. How many albums? Uh, it, it's, it's, it's the complete, uh, Beatles collection. Okay, so, people in the chat, who actually still goes to, like, FYE or whatever and, like, buys physical copies of music now? Or, or a better question, who here buys music at all and doesn't just listen to shit on YouTube for free? How did I miss? Am I dumb? I'm dumb. I missed one. Awesome, this is off to a great start. It looks like Captain Kohak actually buys physical music. Yeah, crickets big time. Yeah, I I, I, I still buy phys I still buy physical CDs if it's of like music I really like. Like if there's like an album or a thing that I really that I really love, then I'll go out of my way to get it. Like say like the 
the uh, the uh, Spider Verse soundtrack. I picked that up on the physical because I loved it that much. Yeah, it looks like the only people who are buying CDs are buying them from like different countries. Like for for you know Japan. Now, and... now we're buying shoe. Now we're picking up shoes. I only buy Sonic vinyls. I wish I could get so I would love to get a Sonic vinyl, but they're pretty expensive. All right, does anybody here still go to the mall and buy shoes? I mean, come on, we all know we go to the mall, try on the shoe, and then buy it for twenty dollars off on Amazon, right? Right. Yeah, this game gives me very much, uh, gives me a lot of, uh, what would I call it, uh, like, cl classic arcade, uh, flashbacks. No, I can't go up. And which arcade game does this remind you of? It kind of gives me slight Donkey Kong-esque, uh, uh, flashbacks, just with the way how you have to, like, go up and, the uh, up and down certain escalators and such like that. just very uh it's very simplified jesus christ okay maybe i should simplify this question even further uh, do any of you still go to the mall so it looks like nobody goes to the mall anymore all of us millenni millennials are killing the malls yeah most of them are dead leon <laughs> Stefan, because I can't hear the music or the game or anything, explain to me what it sounds like. It's like... Just repeat it. Tell me if it's good or not. Not really. Would you like? Would you listen to this like, no. in, in the car? No. <laughs> Alright. I would not listen to the Lizzie McGuire On The Go for Game Boy Advance soundtrack. On The, on go. the go. On The Go. Ha! <laughs> Are those grenades? You picking up are they earrings, maybe? Yeah, they're earrings. Okay. <laughs> Just picking up grenades. Smoothies, I mean, do you like Dan Bell? I don't know who that is. Sorry, what, Stefan? No, I'm like, I'm like what is she? I don't even know what, what she's shooting. She's like shooting like dust. It's Kamehameha, the... Haha! <laughs> the, the evil oh, cheerleaders. Yeah. Maybe she's uh, glitter bombing them? Oh, oh I died. Oh well. Yes, Trinitronity, this is on GBA. It's Hotel Mario, says Weirdo. Yep, now it's a. Oh, 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 sorry. Uh, I'm not even paying attention. Alright, so, donations. Um, I don't know if we've already read uh, Geeky Stev, but Geeky Stev donates five bucks and says no new donations. Psych, put this towards Arkham City. It's Arkham City. Wow. Five dollars. And I don't have the bid war thingy. Uh, so I'm just gonna... Hurry up! I think I'm gonna wonder if I'll lose this because I keep getting hit. Oh shit! And Agumami do donates five bucks, saying one raffle ticket, please. You got it, buddy. Hurry up! Oh, I know I'm supposed. I know what I'm supposed to do. Uh, oh well, let me... Nope, I lost. I forgot. I forgot I'm supposed to go in these multiple times. And Lizzie had a heart attack. Oh well. Crap. Oh Jesus Christ, that's <laughs> terrible. That's awful news. So what are, are these like little hedgehogs? Like what? What's on the ground? I have no idea what that's supposed to be. I think it's just like uh, just Urch weird sea urchin. live in, yeah live accessories. Yeah, sea urchin, just bugs. Thing is, I I like it has been so long since I have seen like anything Lizzie McGuire related. So like even just like even just my experience with the show is completely like shot at this moment. I'm like yeah. I, I, I vaguely remember Lizzie McGuire. That's about it, really. Vaguely remember in what sense? Like, did you actually attempt uh, to watch the show? Because I never even like. No, I well, I watched it as a kid, but that's it's like it's been really? years and years since. Yeah, I, I I grew up during this era of like this was one of the first uh, Disney Channel sitcoms that I watched. Wasn't this around the same time Even Stevens was on? Yeah, that's right. 
See, I watched that, but I didn't see this. So. Of course, I watched Even Steven because it's got smooth smoothies in the title. Uh... Okay, so a lot of these levels are very much kind of like puzzles. We just gotta like go and find. Oh, this level you have to collect 69 pizzas. Hey. <laughs> so all you gotta do is just run around and collect shit? Yeah. The, the, this, uh, how, this is basically just the main mode of the game. How many of these are there? I have no idea. I'm just gonna. But it's, it's played like a time trial, so you do as many levels as you can, and then once you fail a level, then you redo the whole thing over again. Oh, uh, kind of like. Um... Donkey Kong Country 2 minigames. Yeah, it's very, that's why I said it's very arcade-esque. Okay, uh, I, I remember how to beat this level, so uh, I'll redo it. Okay. Because you're supposed to go inside the, the, the one, the one, uh, yeah, elevator takes you to uh, different sections, and I forgot that. Because I'm so used to games having you go to separate uh, elevators in order to get to where you need to go. Proto Man says, oh no. I played this so goddamn much when I was a kid. I yeah. feel terrible right now. I, I do have vague memories of playing this as a kid, because I just remember really? like yeah. I, I remember like I one of my uh like yeah, one of our friends did have the like a bun well because uh, there there are three Lizzie McGuire games on GBA and I remember playing or at least watching being played one of them. It might have been this. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, because you said you had vague memories of playing it, I just imagined, like, your parents gave this to you on <laughs> Christmas or some oh, shit. I also, I have a sister. I have a younger sister, so that's also how I would have gotten a game like this. Lipstick! Magical. Hell yeah. Collect 138 lipsticks! What does she need with that much lipstick? Lifetime supply lipstick. Girls are gonna put Sephora out of business. <laughs> <laughs> right. It is funny every time I see Sephora, just I just can't not think of Sephiroth. Sephora. Sephora. Oh, I gotta I gotta jump and fall down this place several times in order to get all these. Alright. Wee. This is fun. Nope. Hmm. <laughs> this is level design. Oh, nice. Awesome. Let's try not to fail this one. That would not. That would not be good. I think I might. I'm going to pull up the soundtrack of this just so I can see what the hell we're doing like. It's literally just the same song repeated over and over. For like every single thing? Yeah, every one of these levels have been the same. Oh boy, it's five left. <sighs> Lizzie, Nightwire, on the go, OST. No! It's not even on YouTube. <laughs> hell yeah. No! One left! No! Uh, if anybody can find the no. music for this game, link it in the chat so I can listen. I think I might lose this. Yes! Fucking, <laughs> I did it. fucking walk cycle trips me up. Oh, I did it. Whoa, check what you just earned. Uh... Fashion match and fun. Oh yeah, because you you basically you play this, and the more you play this, the more uh, new mini games you unlock, and that's basically what you're supposed to do. See, I'm just gonna play this for as far as I can get, and then I'll check out some of the other mini games. And if not, and after that, oh, I got hit. Okay, Stefan, what's the context of this red-headed cheerleader? Uh, I, th I think, as far as I can remember, I think that's supposed to be... I don't know, either that's supposed to be just generic uh, cheerleader, or that's the avatar of, like, her rival or whatever. 
Because I completely forget if there's, like, the other cartoon versions of the other characters uh, in the series. I only, I only actually remember Lizzie herself. Like, it, it, on, like the, the whole kind of conceit of the show is always kind of weird to me, where it's just like, it's just like your average, uh, like, teenage, uh, like, family sitcom thing, only she has, like, this animated avatar that she expresses herself in. Like, there isn't really a reason for it, she just has it. Like, it'll just occasionally cut to her, her animated self just, like, reacting to whatever is going on. She was the original, uh, YouTuber. See that? She had a, she had a little uh, character and oh, it's uh, it's the bottom left, Stefan. Oh no, uh, there, there's a uh, uh, there's an elevator. I think I need to go in. Ah, there we go. Oh, yeah, geez. yeah, because there's an el there was an elevator blocking it, so I had to. There we go. Success. <laughs> and also. Speaking of, uh, since slightly on the topic, uh, since, yeah, again, like, the Lizzie McGuire movie is, which is the, like, the gift, uh, I have seen the Lizzie McGuire movie, but I only ever remember the beginning, the first ten minutes, and the last ten minutes. I have, I don't know, like, what else happens in the whole movie. Like, the beginning part, which is, like, a montage of her, like, getting ready, uh, for her graduation... And then, like, there's, like, the ending where it's her and, like, a double of her, which are, like, singing in Italy. Like, they're singing a pop song. And I have no idea what happens in the middle other than she goes to Italy. Oh, ouch. Whenever making a game for Nintendo, it's never exactly cheap because you always have to subscribe to their format. They always have, like, a very particular Ow. format that you have to, like pay for the rights to so like making a gba game can't technically be that cheap but like they really just phoned it in with this game look at this what do you think people paid for this wow like 30, okay bucks? i think i might lose to this because like now there's like an enemy placement that's really freaking cheap how much do you think this ah, was Stefan, when it came i don't out? know probably like 30 bucks it's definitely Wow, I lost. Didn't care about me at all. I said it like I think like thirty bucks or so. Oh well, I got to level nine. Uh, let's let's go back. Let's see what the games are. Code blue. Let's see what this is. Wait, why are they locked? Because you have to unlock them. Oh. Wait, unlock more of the same game. No, you you play that game to unlock other mini games that you play. Like that's the only game. Oh, this is I'm playing. Um, I'm playing Connect, playing Connect Four. I think I think this is what this is. Why would you move there, Stefan? I don't know. I don't even know what I'm what what this game is. Ah 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 no ah. Okay, good. No, you're doing. What? Uh, oh! No, Stefan, you idiot! Okay, so it is Connect 4. You dingus. Redo. Alright, let's go. The, the, the mouse tripped me up, because I thought that was my mouse, but it's like, no, that's in the game itself. <laughs> that is- why is there a mouse cursor? Oh, nope. I know what he was gonna do. Don't put it there, Steph. No. Yeah. You gotta think like the enemy. Nope. This is exciting. Ah! <laughs> uh, fuck you. Nope. You're kidding your you're kidding your ass hand. I know, I'm not i I'm not good at these games. <laughs> Shit! 
<laughs> no, no more. You suck. I'm not. I'm not good at smart smart games. All right, let's let's see what see what else I'm we got. I'm not good at smart games. Yeah. Fashion match. Gotta stay active. Find your fashion match. Oh, 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 and it's this kind of game. Uh, my costume for the school's Halloween dance party is most likely to be a female vampire because I'd like to look a hot and scary at the same time. A ghost because how hard is it to cut two holes in the sheet? Any costume that lets me look real, really menacing plus shows off my piercings. The second one, the ghost. I'm going to be a ghost. I'm going to an overnight class trip. My pajamas of choice are a big t-shirt with my favorite sports team emblem, most no. expensive nightwear money can buy, my favorite pink ducky pajamas. Ducky pajamas. Ducky obvious. pajamas. Would you ever wear knee socks and sandals? Sure, why not? Not if I want to survive middle school. Only a dork would even ask a question like that. Sorry, but only a dork. Yeah, no, no knee socks and sandals. That's dumb. My ideal date would be wearing a hockey jersey and a backwards baseball cap. Armani or something comparable, otherwise I can't be seen with him. Big black motorcycle boots and a muscle shirt. Boots! Boots! Over the boots. Relaxing at home means jeans and t-shirt, velvet lounging pajamas. Pajamas. Ew. I don't like either of those. Why velvet? I don't know. I just think pajamas. Uh, the store's register closes before I have a chance to buy that way cool jacket. The last one in the store, so I ditch my friends and get home fast so I can find it on the internet. Thank goodness for the web never closes. Head out with my friends to catch a movie. I can shop another day. Stand my ground, demand that they open that stupid register or else. I don't um, like this question. Do whatever you want. Oh. Uh, I'll just go, my friends. Whatever. Go on Amazon. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't care. I'll, I, can, I can get it another time. I'd describe myself as most likely to join future prom queens of America, kickboxing oh. club, dwarf lord gamers. Yeah. None of the above. Dwarf lord gamers. Hell yeah. I lent my favorite shirt to my best friend and she hasn't returned it yet. So I call her up and start screaming how inconsiderate she is. I show up with my <laughs> tough boyfriend and demand that she return it immediately. I tell her to keep it as a present if she likes it so much and buy myself another one just like it. What the hell? The I, second one makes the most sense. I right? would probably be the third one because I'm a loser, so I'm just gonna pick that. Oh damn. Permanent tattoos are cool. I want lots. Not for me. <laughs> Wait, Stefan, pause for a second. Your friend basically steals your shirt, and you say that's okay, and you yes. buy another. <laughs> You're a piece of shit. I know. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Okay. Well, usually I'd like ask them for it back, and if they say no, then I'd be, oh, okay. Um, so I, I don't have any, I don't have any way to get it back. Oh well. Uh, so uh, not for me, not for me. But I'd wear a temporary tattoo if the other girls are wearing them. Uh, uh, <laughs> not... Just because option three is so pathetic. I right, let's do that. All right. <laughs> T-shirt should display your favorite Star Trek or Star Wars character. Be cute. Be worn only in gym and at softball games. I'm gonna go with be cute because I like cute shirts. Oh, yeah. I'm a she geek. You are showing fashion characteristics that are associated with the fashion tribe known as she geek. Consider this a warning: if you slide all the way into dorkdom, your social life may be limited to Saturday nights with Tudgeman playing Dwarf Lord. But hey, it's a free country. If that actually appeals to you, don't let me stand in your way. What a bitch. That was fun. That's rude. That was rude. Your fashion match is extreme jock. You have little to no jock tendencies. This is a good thing, even if you are a jock. There is no reason to dress like one. Wait, what? Oh, awesome. That's good, right? Rebel Outlaw. You do have some minor Rebel Outlaw tendencies. This is a good thing, both for spicing up your fashion style and letting you test and with your, your independent life. spirit. Oh. <laughs> Just like Lizzie, you share some of the same ideas about fashion as Lizzie McGuire. Cool. Cool. Oh, amazing. Kate Clone, when it comes to your approach to fashion, you and Kate Sanders have some things in common. You'd rather go out with the pack than express your own unique fashion style, and you have expensive tastes which could max out your budget. Not a good thing, so be careful. Contrary to Kate's view, bargain is not is not a dirty word. How dare you call me a parrot? Fuck you. I'm not a parrot. I don't get it. Bye bye. Yes, bye bye. All right, let's let's go with let's ask Lizzie something. Ooh, okay. Ask Lizzie a yes or no question, and she will amaze you with her insight. <laughs> Wait, these are predetermined questions. Oh, oh, this is oh, th oh. Th th this is like this is like a stupid uh. 
eight ball. Ah, uh, all right. Uh, all right. You you Wait. ask her a question. Chat. Yeah. Uh, chat. Chat. Ask a question, and we will choose the best ones. I can't see, so Steven will have to choose. Okay, I'll choose the best ones. No, that other guy. Uh, it's okay, Leon. Uh, Tay. So far, we have two. Are you gays? <laughs> Okay, let's ask Lizzie if she's gay. All right. Are you gay, Lizzie? All right, here it is. Are you gay, Lizzie? Please, not even close. Oh, no. Lizzie's... Oh, Lizzie. that's fine. That's she's... fine. That's how she feels. <laughs> uh, okay, do you watch JoJo? Um, how much wood would a woodchuck? Yeah. It's a yes or a no question. Well, they need to be. They need to be yes or no. Well, I mean, they don't need to be, but that's what she wants. So that's what she wants. Will FTCR ever finish? When no, it's, uh... Lizzie. Do you know who killed Tupac? <laughs> <laughs> ask, ask her that. All right. Lizzie, do you know who killed Tupac? <laughs> Sorry, I was listening to my J Lo CD. Can you ask again? She knows. We'll ask her again. She asked you to ask her again. Lizzie, do you know who killed Tupac? Yes, okay. Now can we go to the mall? She admitted it. Here is a question that only Lizzie McGuire can answer, and it comes from home, com Homecoming, Homecoming Gamer. Gamer yeah. Do we need a Sonic Adventure 3? Do only Lizzie knows. All right. Do we need a Sonic Adventure 3? Yikes! No way! How could you even ask? Oh, oh shit. she said it. Ah, uh, shit. You heard it here first. Lizzie McGuire says no. <laughs> Get fucked. Get fucked. Um, I wouldn't mind an, an actual, like, bona fide SA3. Like, I've been kind of against it for a while, but you know what? I, I kind of welcome it. But only in the sense that, you know, you can play different characters with different play styles in different yeah. levels. Yeah. I think that'd be fun. Um... That's what I see an adventure game as. Yeah, and I um, want yeah, and I want like Sonic's control style to be like that, like the SA one and two style. Yeah, that'd be good. Um. Okay. So yes or no questions? Did they stage the moon landing? <laughs> Did they stage the moon landing? A dealish question. Yes. Oh no. <laughs> okay, I have a question for Lizzie. Is the is the Earth flat? <laughs> is the Earth flat, Lizzie? No, but Gordo says you shouldn't stress about stuff like that anyway. Okay, so the Earth is round, but we fixed the moon landing. Gotcha. <laughs> okay. That's fair. Anything else? Um, okay, chat. One last question. Yeah, and then I'll move on to something else. And then we're going to move on one final question and make it good, because I'm going to choose the best one. The itchy and scratchy thing... Scientology 21st Oh, you know what? Here's here's a question that uh, technically two people are asking. Um and here's here's let's I'm going to rephrase it. Lizzie, will all of us find true love? Okay. Lizzie, will all of us find true love? No, but don't blame me! <laughs> <laughs> well. You heard it. I'm sorry. I'm She's... sorry. <laughs> Get fucked, everyone. <laughs> Alright, Stefan, what are we gonna okay. do? Okay, alright, let's. What is fun with friends? I uh, know that, that that that's like the section that of these like these like little like random mini games. I think okay. that that's based let's see what the PDA is. Uh, class tracker. Gotta get organized. Oh. Oh, it's it's literally it's literally just a tracker. Like you can just put put your stuff down. Okay, class. Uh What the hell? Uh, let me pull out my Game Boy so I know uh, which which class I have to go to next. Fund. Oh boy. T C R. That's too long. 
Yeah, it's a good idea. Fund T C R. Oh, where's the enter button? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I don't know what 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 are what are the how do I get out of? Uh, oh, there we go. <laughs> Teacher. Uh, we could have just hit back, but yeah. you didn't. Smooth. Just put smooth. Professor Smoothies. Oh boy. Um. Do you remember? Stephen, what else? What else is there in this game? I'm pretty sure this is everything that's left in this if game. If that's if that's all there, if we've seen everything. I. I think. Yeah. Well, wait, what? what well, is there anything that we haven't seen besides okay. the locked stuff? I see. Oh, there, oh, there's a horoscope. Yes. Press the L and R button to browse through your best friends or enter the information manually. When you are ready, select continue to view the horoscope, please. Oh, no, never mind. You got to you got to enter everybody. You had to enter like somebody's like name and their birthday. Oh my god. Should we just do this? Do we just do one person? Okay, we'll do Well, do you want well, Spark, Spark, Sparkly says, "Do smoothies." Um, chat. Who should? Well, I don't know anyone else's birthday other than my own. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll just do you. Okay. Everybody gets to know my birthday. And my birthday is coming up. In turn thirty. In turn thirty. I'm gonna turn thirty. This is exciting. Oh my Jesus Christ, don't... Do you really have to put in the name? Wait, you don't put in my... Okay, all right, there you go, Steven. In... Steven's fine, just put in 1023. Okay. Birthday. And this is American, so you gotta put the month first. Yeah, yeah we, we do month what? first as well. Oh, Why what? would it give you the option to put in, in letters? Well, oh, Studio the... Odyssey, your your uh, your birthday's tomorrow. W which one? Which one is it again? Uh, ten. ten. Yeah, ten. Let's, uh... Sorry, we already got our momentum going, everybody. Otherwise, I would have done uh, Studio Odyssey, considering his birthday uh, is tomorrow. <clears throat> ten, uh, October what? Or, or her? Or there? Sorry, I don't know. Sorry, assumed. What is it? Uh, ten, two, three. Yep. Stefan, I kind of feel like we should just do Studio Odyssey. It's not, it wouldn't take that much longer, would it? Okay, wait, so, uh, hold on. Just put it, just put it 8, 16. Odyssey, what, what year were you born? Or are you, if you're uncomfortable with that, then, then we're not gonna, we'll just make up a year. It doesn't really matter. It's a horoscope. Yeah. Your, your, your year shouldn't matter, right? Depends if we're doing astrology or Chinese uh, calendar. Uh, okay, they say 2001. Little baby. You're a little. Oh, you just. You're about to turn 18. Or. Yeah. This movie doesn't want us to know he is a robot and has no age. You're like five days away from my wife's birthday. What the fuck? Probably. I spelled Odyssey wrong, but I don't care. <laughs> Odyssey. Okay, okay so you, you said 2001. Two th okay, Jesus, this is taking so long. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> I love it. 2001. Yeah, 816, 2001. And today is... 815. Thank you for redoing that, Stefan. You're really yeah. quick at it. Right, that's, uh, A... 15. Our little studio Odyssey is turning into an adult. Although by British standards, I think the age of consent is 16? Or did they finally change that? I hope they changed that. Oh. There did we it go. Don't... No, it almost froze, but it's fine. No, nope, that was my fault. Yeah. <laughs> it almost froze. All right, so continue. Wow, everybody's Fam saying it's still 16. Yeah. Family matters may become a bit trying, but all uh -oh. will work out for the best in the end. Is that it? Yep, that's his horoscope. You gotta do that much effort for that little reward. 
Oh, oh, if you if you go shopping this week, you might want to think about making that change in your wardrobe. The stars say it's a good time to do it. Okay. That's very exciting. The one you're so, uh, the one you're crushing on will be super surprised to hear how you feel. Now is a good time to consider getting your feelings out in the open. Oh shit, Odyssey. So uh that yeah, that's it. Uh, with So Odyssey, um you might have some family issues, but use that birthday money, go buy yourself something nice, and uh, go tell that special someone how you feel. I like that. I like how that turned out. That was nice. Yeah, so that's that's literally everything, but since we still have time, I'm just gonna, haha, -ha, I'm gonna close, and I'm gonna open... Wait, what are we doing now? I'm gonna show off the... Oh, oh, while you do that... Wait, what are you showing? Because since we still have time, I'm just going to play the second game. Because there are three games, and I have all three of them on here, so... <laughs> well, I've been abusing or neglecting... Uh, go go uh, read some donations, yeah. So, Cookie Saver 892 donates five bucks and says, I used to love Lizzie McGuire, so I'm the opposite of smoothies and never watched even Stevens. Hey, that's that's really funny. Uh, put this towards the daily raffle. I'll donate more if anyone can sing any Hillary Duff song for at least thirty seconds. I don't. Okay, I think all right. I can do. I can do that because I was literally just listening to that ending song from, uh, from Liz the Lizzie McGuire movie like right before I got here because I wanted a refresher. Uh, oh, um, this is the game I remember playing because I remember this. This is the one I played when I was a kid. I think this one's like an actual. Yeah, this one's an actual level. And we got five bucks from Hero Ow. Art, who uh, says, Hey, Lizzie, what is the philosophical meaning of life? So maybe we'll ask her that when we're done with this. Okay. But it's just going to be a yes or no, so <laughs> she'll probably just be like, Hey, don't ask me. Okay, so Stefan has to sing some sort of Hillary Duff song. Right. Let me, oh, yeah, let me just, to... yeah, I'm going to play through this for a second, and then I'll... And I'll do it. All right, cool. And I'm gonna put Cookie Saver in for the raffle. Yeah. See now, at least at least this is an actual game. Oh, oh I can jump! I can jump on the nerd. Hey, the animation's a little better too. Yeah. I mean that that jump animation's gonna get boring pretty fast. Why are you stomping the nerds? Because I gotta get my books. That's fucked up! <laughs> Lizzie's the cool girl, though. She's cool and she's stomping nerds. What makes her so cool anyway? Well, she, 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 she's, wa she's the wannabe cool girl. She's like, she wants to be popular and all that, but she isn't because she is like uh, goofy. Ow. I got attacked okay. by books. So, Oops. Stefan, uh, what is, what is, like, what are usually the morals of the episodes? Like, it's like, is it like, hey, it's okay to be yourself, don't worry about being popular, just that, worry about doing you? I think that's pretty much, that, that, that's, that's pretty much it. Like, like, like every, Lucy McGuire, it's pretty much like, oh, I died. That was my fault. <laughs> I'm not, she, <laughs> every episode, every Lizzie episode died. is death. <laughs> yeah, it, it, as far as I can remember, because it's been so long since I've really watched anything Lizzie McGuire. Living here on this yeah. dark island. <laughs> It's been it's basic yeah, it's basically just uh yeah, just she she wants to be popular or whatever, she like does some things at school and I fell through the hole. Uh, this is the most dangerous school in the world. Oh killer Killer paper. Lizzie, you are late to class. I will not take uh, your usual excuse of uh, 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 wet floors and holes. And killer, and killer paper, paper airplane, paper airplanes. Ow. Airplane. Airplanes. Ow. How did that hit me? Is this the whole game? Uh, this is the first level. But I mean, like, is the whole game like this? I I think so. It's a platformer. You know, this reminds me a lot of all real monsters on uh, the Genesis. I can see that. Ooh, that would have been that would have been a really fun game to put in this marathon. It's such like a <laughs> Lizzie has Crash Bandicoot levels of death animation. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, I just want to get through this level first and then I'll see what's next. Troy, who do you think looks like they're in elementary school? Because I don't... The, the elementary little, Yeah, the the, 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 those like smaller kids I'm bouncing on. Uh, okay. Yeah, those ones. Yeah, they look like they should be in elementary school. Because there's, there's no lockers in elementary school. You just stay in the same class. Oh, I missed. Time. Damn it. No. No, I need of, that. There's a lot of bathrooms in this Oh, I can't get it, because I, 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 I hit the nerd at the wrong spot. <laughs> what? Just like you and me in bed. Oh. <laughs> Studio said, can we turn the game off? It's getting too relatable. <laughs> oh, she got stabbed again. I'm almost, I'm, I'm near the end of this level, so... It's almost done. It's almost through. Ow. You tricked me! You tricked me with your changing patterns. Hmm. Okay, so... Uh, Mike donates five bucks and says, Hey now... Hey now, now. <laughs> this is what uh, dreams are made of. That's literally what he wrote. This is what dreams are made of. Put this towards the daily raffle because it's too hilariously random not to. Sure thing, Mike. Mike. Yeah, uh, that that Mike. was what that was what I was gonna sing. Hey now. Hey now. <laughs> and as soon as I can remember the link for the thing, Bob, I'll put all of you people in the raffle. Oh, um, yep. Now I gotta. Now it's a food fight. Defeat the lunch lady. What did she do? <sighs> yeah, it's like a, it's an actual. Yeah, it's an actual food fight. Yoink! I want to play this multiplayer. Whoops. My bad. Even even if like you could just chalk up the, the, the giant chairs to bad perspective, but even when she's like next to them, they're still way too big. Oh my Bam. god, what is this? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Ow. Uh, this movie is what is your favorite Disney licensed game? I haven't played that many. Oh. Um, so I'd probably say Castle of Illusion, the PS3, or no, I guess the HD version. It's a good one. It's a really fun game. It's actually a pretty solid game. I recommend it. Bam. Has a food fight even actually broken out Ow. in school in real life? Not in my school because uh, you get a lot of trouble. <laughs> they killed themselves. At my high school, there was a senior prank where um, people who had gradu graduated the year previously they came in with a bunch of water guns and just started spraying down the whole cafeteria, but they got arrested and like uh, they went to jail because like the whole you know guns thing. They were water guns, but still, like, yeah, no, it's a serious fucking thing that happened at my high school. <laughs> yeah. It didn't fly back then, either. It was, like, almost ten years ago. No, it was ten years ago. Of course it wouldn't fly. No, they'd, give, they'd get in even more trouble now, but yeah, no. Got arrested. Uh, stupid. Just, like, a stupid thing. Like, why would you do that? I don't know. Oh, studio, that's Ow. terrible. They weren't arrested for having water guns. They were arrested for trespassing and for scaring everyone. So it's more so about the panic. I'm sorry. We need to get on a lighter subject. <laughs> no. Get him. 
Stefan, tell me what Canadian school. How many grades are there? We have uh, twelve. Well, we there's a, there's a junior kindergarten and kindergarten uh, grades one to eight, which is elementary school. Uh, then grades nine to ten. One through eight is elementary. And then nine to twelve is uh is high school. Okay, so we have like one through six is elementary, and then eight 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 and no seven and eight are what's considered middle school. Okay, I guess that makes sense. Bam. How is my sex life? Hmm. I deserve that. Wait, what is that? Is that a Florida thing? That's just, I don't, I have no idea. Oh, in Kentucky. Yeah, okay, oh, so. Uh, the lunch lady. Okay, so this is who we have to defeat. Yeah. Stefan, I don't know if I should keep talking about my stupid life or we should talk about this game. So tell me about this lunch lady thing. Uh, I don't even remember. I didn't even know that there was a lunch lady in the series. So, so she just has a big pot of mashed potatoes. And that's it. Bam. I think it's like a food fight erupted and she's mad. So and we're, 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 we're basically just defending ourselves. All you got to do is block. Well, no, you block to pick up the item, and then you throw it at them. Oh. Ah, ow. Ah, oh, her knee. Congratulations. Okay, so yeah. Uh, studio, you have the same thing that I have. Very interesting. So it looks like even my own country is inconsistent with what they think the grade should be. I hate uh, this country. All right, I'll, 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 I'll sing that, uh, I'll sing that uh, Hillary Duff song now while I'm, yeah, playing, while I'm playing this. Yeah. Let me just make sure. Uh, oh, Dude. great. Actually, no, wait. I need to. I think I need a constrict. So now I'm playing tennis. Ow. Uh, hell yeah. Stefan. Oh, awesome. Aha! Uh -huh. I don't know how to play tennis. Oh, apparently this is badminton. Or badminton. I lost. Ah, uh, ah, uh, nice. How, what am I supposed to do? I like. I actually don't know what I'm. Stefan, this is exciting. I like how the. I like how the badminton. Is, is it called a badminton? Like the little thing that you hit? It's called a birdie. Okay, so I like how the bird's shadow is as big as yours. <laughs> Just okay, I, I don't know why the like... Oh. <laughs> You're terrible at this. <laughs> the birdie, okay. Ha, I got a point! Shuttlecock. Nice. I like that. It's a shuttlecock. Oh. Bacon flavored shotgun. Oh well. Haha, <laughs> they said shuttle. Jesus Christ, Stefan, is there anything else? <laughs> no, I think that's I think that's it until I can beat this. So I'm just I'm just gonna play it until it's the end. Okay, you play that and give us a song. Okay, let me let me see if I can let me see if I can multitask. You can do it. Have you ever seen such a beautiful night? Oh boy. I could almost kiss the stars. They're shining so bright. When I see the smiling like go, oh, 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 I would ever want to miss this, cause in my heart I know what this is, uh, hey now, uh, hey now, this is what dreams are made of, uh, hey now, uh, hey now, this is what dreams are made of. I Stephen, got... continue, this, continue this in Black Doom voice. I've got somewhere I belong. I've got somebody to love. <laughs> this is what <laughs> dreams are made of. Perfect.
Yeah. This trips is this, me. Is that, yeah. Is that like the theme or like? It, it, yeah, it's like well, it's like the end. That that's like the ending theme from the movie. Okay. How many times have you seen the film? Like, it's been long time since I've ever seen it. But like that that song always stuck in my head because that was the. That's my question. I don't know how many times you watched it. Uh, the whole thing, uh, once years ago, I think I've probably seen that as a kid, like, many times. I saw that, I, I've, I've heard that song many times. Okay. Yeah, because like I said, I've only ever really watched the beginning and the end. Oh. Like, I know, I think the the middle part, I think, like, the actual plot is, like, has something to do with, like, Lizzie going to Italy, and then she finds, like, a doppelganger who's, like, a pop star that looks exactly like her, and she ends up, like, unraveled in this, like, plot where, like, they want to, like, replace her with her, and it's, like, it's, it, I don't, I don't even know, like, exactly, it's just this weird thing where she meets, she meets someone who looks, like, exactly like her, and it's a pop star, and it basically just gives her an excuse to sing, like, have a big pop star number at the end. Stefan, I need you. Can you. Can you bake me a sandwich? No! <laughs> okay. Oh. So, in about five minutes, uh, we will um, be switching over to. Oh, Jesus, another pinball thing. What's it? But what's like the actual. Pinball, pinball FX3. 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 Damn it. <laughs> Pinball FX3? Or not. Ah, come on. I would like to uh, thank everybody, uh, since we're about to leave, uh, for helping us raise money for uh, the International Rescue Committee today. Uh, they're a very important organization who respond to emergencies um, and help those who are uh, uh, shattered by conflict Damn. and disaster. By uh, uh, doing things such as reuniting refugee families and um, who are who are like separated by war or who are just needing to escape uh, war torn areas or providing kids with educational opportunities, it's a fantastic cause, and we want to thank you so much for doing it. Stephen, I won! I won! Oh yay! Stefan did it. No, Stefan, uh -huh. thank everybody. Thank everybody for their contribution. Thank you for enjoying the, the, this this mess uh, of Lizzie McGuire one and oh, two. <laughs> we, we we managed to fit an hour in, thank so the, I'll thank take them that. For the money. Thank thank you for the money too. Thank you for giving us money <laughs> to uh, to play this and for everything. Just, just, just for, and especially like for the rest, because I know a lot of you guys also raised a lot of money at the beginning for Lego Star Wars, and just like, like how much we were, we're like close, are we close to 8k or are we past 8k? By we now? are past 8k. Yeah, nice. Yeah, that, that's amazing. Uh, what's the exact number at the moment? 8,347. Nice. Which means we are ha past our goal, or no, we're past half, we're, we're halfway past, Jesus Christ, we are halfway past our goal, and we're like halfway through the marathon, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. so keep, yeah, keep on giving that money, uh, yeah, today, uh, right, right, <laughs> right after this is pinball with Donnie, so, yeah, you might want to, might want to, like, throw in some more for him there, and then right after that is Elliot with Toy Story 2, so that'll be another really fun one and crazy one, so, yeah, the, you got lots more, and remember, tonight, the Batman Arkham bid war concludes. So if that you if, if you want to put any more money into City or Night, uh, go do that. Now someone put five bucks into City, so I need to update that stuff. And can you like give me the link? I can't uh, find the link. Well, I mean, I'll go to the go to the charity room website and then just go to the like just go to like the bottom of it. Oh, just edit right if there. I'm logged in, I can just yeah. Edit it. There you go. Fancy. Hell yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. So thank you so good. much for joining. All right. And I'm going to go down to the thing in my bottom and put $5 into city. Ba-da-ba-ba-da-ba.